Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, this is a question from viewers. I had a few questions on this one. And um, so there was an update that not everyone had. This update shows up depending on the machine you have and it's not the same on every machine. Uh, so if we go and check out the um, app and features list you have in this list of apps update for Windows 10 uh, x64 KB 517 16 and this if you look at Windows update in my case this update was in the past but was, was pushed again to my system um, with patch Tuesday this week so if I look at update history um, you'll notice that this update is here but if I go back in time there is also in March KB 517.16 here. And if you continue, it installed at other times in the past also. So what's this thing all about? What is it? What is, there you go, it was installed also in October of last year. So it shows you that it was installed several times. So this update has to do with the Windows Update stack. And... Actually, um, after a little digging, I found a little more info actually on what it does. So when you get a pop-up on your screen that says, oh, you want to go to Windows 11? Yes or no? And, you know, um, or any other types of pop-up of that kind, it is that update that does that. So this has to do with the pop-ups that tell you if you want to move on, if you want to have a new version. For example, if a pop-up shows up, um, and says, well, you know, you're not up to date. You want to move on to the newest version. This is the update that does that, apparently. And it was pushed for a lot of people this week because there was a mess, uh, a post that I saw that a lot of people had it, but not everybody. Once again, you might not have got this update this week. But if you go through your Windows 10 install, you'll see that it, it was installed several times over the last, uh, you know, year. Now, apparently the new version just pushed now has two pop-ups that it can show. If your PC is compatible with Windows um, 11 and you're on Windows 10, you will get the pop-up that says, hey, you want to move on to the new version of Windows? And if, like me on this system, you are, you don't meet the minimum system requirements, Apparently, it will at some point pop up and tell you one of the reasons why you can't move on. What's your PC missing for you to move on to uh, Windows 11? So that's pretty much it. Uh, and yes, it's one of the only updates that appears in the app list. So if you go into your uh, apps in Windows 10 and go down to the section which we're um, where it tells you that there's updates. I'll go down, go down uh, here. It's update for Windows 10. This is the same update, KB 517.16. It shows up, and it has a version number. So you'll see that every time you have an update for this, you'll see this version number actually change. So it really has to do with pop-ups about things. If you uninstall it, yeah, it will prevent the pop-ups from happening, but the problem is it's, it's probably going to show back it's going to show up in uh, in the Windows updates again. If you don't want to have pop-ups, um, you can remove this update and actually hide it. Uh, it won't break anything since it's not cumulative. This update is on its own. So that's what it's all about on uh, this update that uh, pops up from time to time on Windows 10. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.